guys, I am so excited because I am a big fan of our next guest. She was Jade Wesker in Netflix's Resident Evil and is the voice for the new Forspoken game. Ella Belinska is tackling the gaming world from the other side and is bringing us the content gamers dream of. Hey, Ella. What's up, girl? How are you? I'm good, I'm good. How oh are you? Oh my gosh, I'm good, girl. I'm freaking out just a little bit. I am such a huge fan. Thank you. I'm so I'm so happy to be here, honestly. Ah. It's, it's And this is already a very competitive situation, mm -hmm. which I am excited to dive into. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna explain to you what we're gonna do. Okay. okay. So we're going to play Jenga to get to know you better. The tower has four different colors. Each color represents a theme. Purple for childhood memories, red for career, green for inspiration, and blue for a challenge. Ready? All right, let's do it. Okay, girl. <laughs> okay, I think I'm gonna go for it. Purple. This one's calling. Nice. Yeah. That's two from one side. Woo! <gasps> Gotta balance this baby out. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> okay. This one is childhood memories. Did you play games growing up? And if so, what were your favorite games? When I was super young, I didn't have any siblings. So my replacement sibling was my game consoles. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I absolutely loved Earthworm Jim. I loved Street Fighter. Tekken was my game. Uh, so definitely sort of fighting style. And then of course the Marios. I mean, where would we be? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so um, we're gonna go for, we've got to balance out this thing. Oh. Okay, I'm getting into this now. Woo. Here we go, here what she goes. We there we go. Bang. Beautiful. There we go. Ooh, Ella wanted a challenge. We want a challenge. It's gonna be a challenge question. List as many female game characters as possible. You have 10 seconds, set, go. Okay, uh, Rosalie, Ro Rosalind, uh, Princess Peach, um, we got Horizon, Jet, uh, oh my god, goodness, we got uh, Cammy from Street Fighter, uh, Chun Li. Um, ah! <laughs> this is so That's stressful. Okay. Uh, Half a second. Bray Holland okay. from Force Spoken. Yeah, <laughs> I had to let you get that last one in. <laughs> that was good, though. That was good. You named a lot. Give me one more. Give me one more. Samus. Mm. Icon. That's a good one. That's my, arguably my favorite. Yeah. Sorry for saying that last, but you know. No, that's right. You know. Okay. Here, yeah. You're in. So, Alrighty. So I'm going to give you the note that we're leaning slightly this way. <laughs> to, the, to the right. We're going to the right. We're going slightly this way right now. So okay. I'm going to do like a 360 of this because I really. We have not done green. Green's okay. looking a bit lonely. Ah! Okay. Oh. Ew. Oh, there we oh, go. Middle piece. Yeah. Like balancing out. Uh, the middle piece is always my friend. Inspiration. What kind of differences have you seen games make in your life? There's two things, I suppose. One is always just the joy it brings me, the escapism. It's called of being able to just lose yourself in a story. Mm -hmm. And then number two, I think just the dexterity of my fingers. I'm just fast. Oh yeah. You know, especially with all the stunts that I do mm -hmm. and I don't know, typing on my phone or anything. <laughs> uh, it makes me really quick, but I think that hand-eye coordination is really important and it's those motor skills, practicing those motor skills are really cool. Wow. Yeah, you know, yeah girl, I know that's right. Um, okay. I'm like, I'm this, whoop. Okay, we're trying, to, we're trying to balance it out. I'm gonna so push your green along a little bit. <laughs> Beautiful. Tell us about being the voice of Forspoken and how it has impacted your life. Being the voice of Forspoken for me is, is like a massive career moment, not just as, a, as an actress, but also just as a kid that I am inside. I, I always loved games. I always loved being able to pick the female character I played. I'd always do it to try and make them look as much like me as possible. So yeah. being able to actually play myself is like a huge step forward in my career and also step forward for the industry. Wow, I love that. And we need more of that in the yes. industry. All right, awesome. Okay, that last one was you. I'm feeling the pressure, I'm feeling the pressure. Oh wow, we're going, ooh. We're going blue. We're going, okay, no, we're going, I oh, think ooh. I'm gonna, ooh. Nice, okay, smash it. Lovely. Okay, inspiration. Is there anyone in the gaming world that inspires you? This might seem like such a cliche answer, but honestly, you guys. <laughs> honestly, oh, I'm so, 
I'm so happy to be here and I've always loved your work and I think everything that you're doing is really important and oh you inspire my. so many young women out there and I just think that's just so amazing and I'm inspired myself right now. Wow! <laughs> oh my god! There you go. <laughs> what? Thank you! And we are absolutely inspired by women like you who are just making waves in any way that you possibly can, including DJing. Watch out for her. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I what I'm sorry, I have to ask, what's your DJ name? Bax, B-A-X. Bax. Also my gamer tag. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> she's like she's like undercover, like nobody knows that it's you, yes. but it's like you. Oh yeah. 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 Okay. Um, let's go in with the you know, I'm feeling, I'm feeling green. Feeling green? Yes. Nope, Ooh. not, I'm feeling green, but not that green. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling a different green, Ooh. which is apparently this green. Oh, that's, it was perfect. I'm telling you, the blocks just call your name. It's the nails. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, it's the nails. Yeah. There we are. If you could create a game with no restrictions, like no budget at all, mm. what will it be? Futuristic Sims. Think cyberpunk for spoken Sims as all the characters in the town. Like, I'd cast my friends in it. Oh, that's you so know? cute. And I'd be like, hey guys, you wanna come be in this game? We'll yeah. do like a full body scan and we'll load you in. <laughs> that's so cute. You should like play your real life in a video game. Yes. That would be so cute. Okay, oh man. Oh man, I'm gonna go for a blue. Yeah, it's, it's, looking, it's looking blue heavy here. It's looking blue. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, you know it's getting tense, so you gotta push them out. <laughs> like, <laughs> I thought that was gonna be the one. I thought we were gonna be through. Oh my goodness, that was great. Okay, awesome. Being a black woman in the entertainment industry is a challenge, definitely. So what advice would you give to young viewers who wanna be actors in the gaming space? I um, studied at a drama school. I then went from drama school into shooting sort of TV shows here and there. And it was funny because with my team, they would put me forward for roles that I never would have thought I would have been seen for. Mm -hmm. And I think that there was a show that I did in the UK where the lead character, I think was supposed to be from Germany and she was written with blonde hair and blue eyes. And my team were like, you would be great. It, your version of this character would be fantastic. Go in and read for it. And I booked the job. Wow. And just because you might think you're in a specific box doesn't mean you need to stay in it. You as an actor, if you're wanting to come into this space, is definitely a place where you will be welcomed with open arms because it doesn't matter who you are, where you came from or what you look like, you'll make an impact regardless. Mm, I love that. And I love that you mentioned going into spaces that you don't really see yourself in. Yes. That's exactly what we're trying to get our viewers to see. And <laughs> look at look the shooting and she's been scoring. So. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Uh, oh, I love that. Great. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. I'm just gonna do it. Okay. Oh man. I know this is. Oh. Uh, what about that middle and that? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. I tried it. It did not. Oh wow. There we okay. Go. We got a middle okay. one. Wait. Oh. But she's she's a stubborn one. I know. She's like. She's like I don't want to come out. No. Nope. Okay. We can breathe. I am enough. I am enough. Ooh. Whoa! God, what a save! I get, wow, I get, that is I get, I get. clutch at the last. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! No. You, I think you have to yell you Jenga. Won, though. We have to yell oh. Jenga. Jenga! <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! You know how many times I've played Jenga and I've actually never yelled Jenga. Well, that's the best part Locked of it. it down. I didn't know that. Oh yeah, you got to tell all my friends we've been playing Jenga wrong. <laughs> <laughs> that's the best bit. You gotta yeah. yell Jenga. I just want to say thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for all that you're doing in the gaming industry and in the acting industry. And just thank you for being you and being so encouraging to our young viewers. Thank you so much for having me. Honestly, this has been great. I'm really excited to see what all of our viewers and audiences um, do in the future. Yes, absolutely. And I'm so excited to see your upcoming work as well. Thank you. Yeah, thank of you. course. All right, guys, that's all we have for today. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good one.